GSIS members and pensioners affected by the magnitude 7 earthquake may avail of an emergency loan from the agency's calamity fund. An official of GSIS was quick to clarify, though, that such privilege can only be availed of by members and pensioners from the province of Abra, which was recently placed under a state of calamity. Jillian Geronimo has the full details. Members and pensioners of the government service insurance system may avail of emergency loans from the agency's 5.4 billion peso calamity fund. GSIS President and General Manager Wick Veloso said the emergency loan is for members affected by the magnitude 7 earthquake that hit Abra on Wednesday. GSIS members with existing emergency loan balance may borrow up to 40,000 pesos to pay off their balances. They will still receive a maximum net amount of 20,000 pesos like those without outstanding loan balance. The loans may be paid within 36 months with a 6% interest. Pwede sila mag-avail nitong calamity fund sapagkat pag ikaw ay nagkaroon ng sitwasyon na mawalan ka ng bahay o masira ang iyong uh, tirahan ay importante na malaman mo na meron ka matatakbuhan agad. It will give you the peace of mind. Veloso explained that the Calamity Fund is only for GSIS members and pensioners in areas like Abra, which has declared a state of calamity. Members in areas affected by the tremor but have yet to declare a state of calamity may still avail of a loan, but this will be considered a multi-purpose loan instead of coming from the Calamity Fund. Meanwhile, Veloso highlights the agency's mobile app called GSIS Touch as well as its portable kiosk, which are some of the ways members may apply for alone. The GSIS has more than 5,700 members and pensioners in Abra alone, according to the GSIS president. Jillian Geronimo for The Nation.